So guys, just wanted to do a real quick unboxing of the um, Gucci Lion Ring. Um, I'll show you in the last video, uh, or one of the last videos, I did a review of the Gucci uh, brass color gold tone necklace. And I'll give you an update on that. Um, I've had it for quite a while now, and it's just it's running great there's no i have no issues with allergy at first i was thinking maybe it's got an allergy because it's not gold you know it's like a, a brass or or whatever but no issues at all i can't believe it like um anyway i'll give you kind of an update on that but let's go ahead and open this up first really quick i'll just show you the um the lion head um it is solid i think it's solid brass it's i mean it has to be because it hasn't, um, it's not like it's, you know, plated where there's something underneath. It's, um, there's just no allergic reaction. It's, it's, you know, you, you do pay, you pay over $300 for it. So I, I would assume that it wouldn't give you an allergic reaction, but you know, I'm always worried when I'm buying stuff that's not gold or platinum, um, that, you know, it's going to give me an allergic thing, but no, this is just a, it's just like wearing gold. Uh, I love it. Okay, so uh, just got this in the mail a few minutes ago. Um, looks like they did some great packaging, like always. Even their boxes are amazing. Um, let's go ahead and pull everything out. Oh, cool. They sent me another dust bag. Um, that's weird. I don't know what that those two O's are, I guess. I don't think I've ever seen that before in my other dust bags. Um, let's see. It's just an empty dust bag. Um, let's see what else in here? Nothing. Um, and then you have your envelope. I, I assume that this is just the receipt. Okay, no receipt, but it just says, uh, thank you for shopping with us at Gucci.com. Each item has been skillfully designed, made using the highest quality. Okay, I know that that's not really... What you guys want to see anyway here we go they always do a good job at um, putting on their ribbons yeah cool nice little bag this is kind of the same I know uh, different color but in it's same kind of uh, bag with the two drawstrings. Oh wow, that's cool, so cool. Right, let's take. Well, first let's see if it fits. That's the. That is the big question. Absolutely beautiful. Fits just right. I have a ring sizer, so um, I have the ring size shaft that you can actually drop your rings on so like for instance this ring I drop it onto the shaft and it, it stops where the size is so that works good and then I have also a key ring full of um, r different ring sizes with the numbers on them so anytime I buy I always test to make sure um, and then you have to of course um, change it from the Italian to the US but Gucci has all that on their on their paperwork or on their um, website okay so anyway, looks great. Again, I I wanted it to to I wanted something to match this. Um, I have a feline Gucci sterling silver feline necklace with the matching feline ring, and I I always wanted to get the matching ring for this set. Um, unfortunately, I have sausage fingers, and um, they didn't have anything that fit. Um, I think the highest size they had was a 25, which would fit my uh, ring finger, but it said to they, they didn't have it online. You had to find in store, and I think the the size down from that was like um, a 23 or something, and that just would not fit. Um, that'd be super tight, so had to go with the pinky, but that's fine. Um, I like pinky rings and. Um, you know, I'll be wearing it on occasions. Um, but this I've worn every day now for, I don't know, at least two or three months and no issues. 
every day in the sweat, played sports with it, um, worked in a hospital, ran all over the hospital with it underneath my shirt, and had no issues. Let's look at the markings on this uh, ring. Okay, I hope you can see that. It's got the letter I as in India. Um, I don't know on the periodic table what that is. I believe it's an I. I don't think it's an L. Um, and I just lost it. It's hard to do this loop through here. Um, uh, so, yeah. Uh, and it has the same thing on the uh, clasp of the necklace. It has the letter uh, I. Oh, shoot. I can't do this. Anyway. I think I showed it on my last video. But, anyway. Um... So, I don't know, yeah. Uh, anybody, any um, chemists out there that uh, know the um, periodic uh, table? I know that on uh, Gucci's Sterling Silver, they have um, AG for silver. And then on the gold, it's AU. So, I'm just curious to know what I is. Uh, I remember trying to look it up on the internet before to see if it's like brass or anything. But I can't find it. And I know it's a periodic uh, mark because... Um, it says, it has a square around the letter, so that's usually a good indicator. Um, okay, and then moving on, we have size 15, uh, on the inside there, and it does have a very, very small print. Let's see if I can stand by. All right, and then on the very, very inside, it does have a Gucci made in Italy. Sorry, guys, this is really hard. Sorry. Anyway, and I apologize again about the lack of bipod. Um, I usually do these videos on the fly, usually because I get the box, I want to open it up, and um, I don't want to have to wait to find a tripod and all that stuff. So anyway, there you guys go. Um, the Gucci... Uh, matching set, uh, necklace and ring, um, and yeah, I just wanted to show you guys, uh, very excited about these, I've really always enjoyed uh, Gucci's jewelry and what uh, um, Alessandro Michelli, um, or Michelli if you want to pronounce it, ecclesiastical, um, I really am enjoying what he's doing with the company and the artwork that he's doing. So, and I like this because it's very masculine, you know. Um, and you could actually you could dress it down with, uh, you know, I could see a female rocking this, and I have seen females rocking um, these rings. So, and they look great in them. So, it's one of those things you d you can go, you know, both ways on it. So, anyway, all right, take care. Um, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. And um, just for your information, uh, a size 15 is about a seven and a quarter, seven and a half, it depends on who you're talking to, um, ring. And that's how I converted. Um, so, all right. Talk to you later.